back here in upstate New York. About 20 degrees out, middle of February. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about this EX4. People have been saying how it's a grease problem, so I've cooked burgers and chicken on it so far. Not a ton, but this is what I'm looking at. Kind of scraped down the uh, flavorizer bars, and I'm just going to pull those out and take a look here. A bit of ash in the bottom. Doesn't exactly fall through as advertised, but I wouldn't say it's a ton. I've gone through about a bag of pellets, roughly, between the burn in and the two meals. So it's a decent amount. The burn pot is uh not got anything really in it so that worked all right there's a couple of half burns in there but overall not bad just scrape this down the rest of the way and clean it out we'll be back so i got this thing scraped down just use the factory scraper no scotch rights or anything figured that was how they designed it to be a uh, couple things that i noticed in doing it one there's two bolts one right here and one right here it would have been nice to have a carriage bolt there because when you're scraping you bang into them they're buried under ash so that's a kind of a design flaw in my opinion the other big thing is if you can kind of see underneath the shelf here all the ash and everything sits there not as much grease but a ton of ash just built up back there it's a pretty good spot and it would have been nice to have some kind of side shield to kind of come down there. So, something to watch for. Not sure if that would be a flare-up issue, but if you get enough half-burned pellets sitting back there, it might be a problem. <laughs> 